Hey everybody, what's going on? So we've got a bunch of Rock Band 4 news today. So before we get started, let's talk about the weekly challenge and rivals. This one was based off of the most played genre last week, uh, which was basically a challenge where you could play any song in your set list. And basically it's going to be an alternative a song week for uh, this week's Rival Challenge. So we've got Cake, I Will Survive, The Feast and the Famine by Foo Fighters, and I Recognize by New Fane. And then let's turn on, let's turn over to our next set of rock band uh, news. So we've got some uh, blogs going up on the Harmonics website. You know, because it's the 10th year anniversary of rock band, we've got different members of Harmonics talking about uh, their experience working there and the past 10 years. So James Fleming is the dude who was uh, responsible for the calibration in rock band. So he might be a guy who probably doesn't have a lot of fans necessarily if you read the comments. And then we've got um, another blog post from uh, Ryan Lesser, who's uh, been around at Harmonix for quite a while. He talked about the past 10 years, and if you guys want to see, hear some behind-the-scenes stuff about Harmonix, you guys can go check those blogs out. I've linked to them down below. And then finally, with PAX East coming up next weekend, uh, Harmonix has released a schedule of what to expect. So March 10th, there's going to be an anniversary party at the Hard Rock Cafe. 11th will be uh, the Harmonix Video Vault, all the new tales from the archives, which I I'm really looking forward to hearing. And then the 12th, it'll just be Harmonix and Friends on Twitch. So that basically does it for today's news. If you guys missed my video earlier in the day, Harmonix has released uh, the first batch of songs that will be available on Rock Band VR. There are some songs we haven't got yet in Rock Band 4 in any previous games, including uh, Gold on the Ceiling by Black uh, by the Black Keys, uh, Champagne Supernova by Oasis, and I think there was a couple other ones too, but those ones were definitely the standouts uh, looking at the set list. So that does it for today's video, guys. Let me know your thoughts. Are you guys excited about PAX East next week? If you remember, almost a year ago, we learned that online play was coming to Rock Band, the PDP adapter was coming. And we've also got some news about the PDP adapter. April still seems to be the month where they'll be getting some more shipments in. They weren't sure exactly how much they'd be getting, but uh, if you guys are looking for one, try hitting up the PDP website around you know later this month or April, and hopefully you can get one. So thanks for watching, guys, and have yourself a good weekend.